guys. It's David Henry again. Thanks for tuning in. You know, my fax and build, I was talking about doing a shorter barrel on it. Guess what showed up in the mail today? Outlier barrels. Let's open this one up and see what Outlier did for us. First off, they give us a nice booklet. That booklet is going to be a round count booklet. You can put your load data in there and then put the date and all the rounds that you put on this barrel. This particular barrel is nitrided coated and they claim it's a shootout guarantee, a lifetime guarantee on the accuracy of this barrel. Let's get it out of the box and just take a look and do a quick inspection. So when they put it in there, it looks like a barbell, you know, it's got the foam edge ends on it. Um, that's just to protect and keep the cap on there, um, just to protect those threads. Man, I tell you what, the machining on this, you can definitely see the machining grooves in there. We'll take a little closer shot for you. Um, it does come with a barrel nut. This one's a rimage style fitment, so it's going to fit on that fal uh, faxon. Um, we're going to use a no-go gauge to make sure it's head spaced right. Uh, it's a one in seven twist, so a little faster twist than the original Faxon barrel. I'm hoping it'll help stabilize some of those heavy bullets. Um, I don't know. I might shoot 147s at it, or I might just try to get some really fast uh, 130s out of it, man. Let me know in the comments what you would like to see. But uh, it is threaded, um, 5 eighths by 24. This thing is an inch 20 diameter straight contour. When you go to the outlier website you know when you go to order a barrel every item you pick there's a little ad charge for it and if you contour it down to an MTU there's an ad charge and I kind of like the thick boy here so I'm going to put that on there I'll run a suppressor so it doesn't look a little silly you know those small threads of that big diameter barrel I'd like to get that a little bigger so I'm going to run a either an OSS can or I have a B&T can Rotex titanium one of those two will be on this build I'm going to put it on that LSS Gen 3 uh, tactical chassis get my barrel net set and then, uh, man, we'll see how this outlier barrel treats me. Thanks a lot, man. Stay tuned. Subscribe if you'd like. Uh, let's see what these builds are going to do. But outlier barrel going on a fax in action, going into MDT LSS3. It's going to be a fun build. Stay tuned. Have a nice day. And David, checking out.